Good morning this midday. Thanks for joining us for our newscast. I'm Marcus Washington and we are following breaking news this morning on the peninsula. Right now we are under a microclimate weather alert. This is due to that storm pounding the Bay Area with the rain. That storm causing major flooding on the peninsula. Cars stalled in water. NBC Bay Area Sierra Johnson. She's live in Millbrae with the latest there. Sierra. Yeah, that fast moving rain really wreaked havoc here in Millbrae. I can tell you this is still a very active situation. About a block and a half behind me is where that situation this morning played out. And right now we can tell you there was a coroner's van on scene. That van has since left. Right now we're at the intersection of Hillcrest and Helmrick here in Millbrae. Now this all started about 545 this morning. This is when uh, law enforcement got a phone call regarding a stranded car there in that high water. I do believe we have video of what that water looked like a couple of hours ago. Uh, police responded to that situation. A man was found standing on top of his car. Uh, first responders then say they spotted another car, but the water was rising so fast they were unable to retrieve it, which brings us to where we are now. A few hours later, Public Works uh, were on scene pumping that water out of that area to receive or to retrieve rather two of those cars. Uh, and it was a similar situation a couple of blocks away, several Homes were flooded because of this high water. Um, about 15 homes near Landing Lane sustained damage because of this home. But back out here, again, uh, they're in the process of retrieving two of those cars. Again, we saw a coroner's van. We do not have any specifics about what the van was doing here. They have since left. And we have also seen a tow truck here. We're assuming to retrieve the vans that are about a block and a half under the underpass here. We're off of El Camino Real on Helmbrick and Hillcrest. So a a lot of a lot of um, information here still to digest. We will, of course, keep you updated both on air and online as those details do become available. We're live in Millbury, Sierra Johnson for NBC Bay Area News. And just a reminder to so many people, if you see water there, you think you can pass through, don't do it. Just turn around. All right, Sierra, thank you. Now, of course, that rain coming down hard this morning across the Bay Area. We want to check in with meteorologist Carrie Hall. She has been following this storm system all week and Carrie. Will we see a break anytime soon when it comes to all this rain that we're getting? Yeah, we are going to see some small breaks here and there, but nothing of significance here. And we are going to continue to see at times some spots where we do get some really heavy rain, but then other areas where it's a lot lighter. And we've seen the rain taking a break for a while up around Santa Rosa, but that was after some earlier heavy rain that we saw in that area that caused a, a flood advisory in Sonoma County as well as Napa County. And for San Mateo County, we're still looking at a steady rain coming down in a lot of these spots as we track it with storms. Storm Ranger. That's our mobile Doppler radar and the red scan that you're seeing. They're still indicating some heavier rain uh, around 280 right around Woodside. And then as we head down to San Jose, there is a brief break, but we are going to see some of the rain continue off and on as we go into this afternoon for parts of the East Bay. Also issues with flooding, especially on those streets. And as Marcus said, you want to make sure that you do not drive over where water covers the road because you just can't tell how deep it is. And these are the kind of problems that we could see in some spots going into the next few days. I'm going to be watching this. We'll talk about how much rain fell and how much more is on the way. Also, the update of the drought monitor. All of that coming up in a few minutes, Marcus. All right, looking forward to it. Thanks, you, Carrie. Well, new video. This one showing more flooding on the peninsula. Check this out. This is a scene from Granada. This is that water coming up to the thigh of some of those first responders. Look at that. Now, Cal Fire says that they are responding to several calls. And this video right here is showing flooding near Half Moon Bay. This is near the airport. You can see those cars driving around in standing water. So, as a reminder again, be careful out there. And in the North Bay, one traveler and his Uber driver, they got stuck in flooded water. So, it happened near Valley Ford in West Sonoma County. The passenger says that he was heading to SFO this morning when the car got caught in about two feet of water on Highway 1. The BMW stalled out and the two were stuck there until fire crews rescued them. Luckily, they were not hurt.